In this video, I'm going to show you how to dynamically inject user controls into posts and pages. First of all, we need a user control, so let's go into Visual Studio and create one. You'll see that I have the uh, blockengine.net website open here, and uh, let's just add the user control to the root of the website. Let's call it test. It's a very simple user control, it just prints out the current date and time. Now, I'm going to save this, and if we're going to add a post here, we'll call it user control, I'm going to write some text, and uh, now we're going to inject the user control, and I want it right here where the cursor is. So I'm going to write some special markup here. I'm gonna write user control colon and then I'm gonna write the relative path to the user control and in this occasion it's test.acx located at the root of the website. Alright, now let's save this and as you can see here, we now have the current date and time. If I'm going to refresh this page, also notice that the time is changing, just as expected. So, this is the syntax. Square bracket, use control, colon, and then the relative path to the use control. You can use this in both pages and posts. And it works with postbacks, Ajax, client callbacks, um, and you can use all your old existing use controls if you'd like. Thank you for watching.